here's the other thing I wanted to bring up. That you ha- have you read the story on uh, Kyle Rittenhouse? I've heard the story. I watched I, it on. I the think I, I think I sent you an article. You sent an article article to me. All I didn't right. get a chance to get to it, but I did. I did see it on the news though. So, yeah, I mean, the only reason I bring it up because I think it ties in into a little bit into what you wanted to bring out and with the the whole rapper's yeah, dying yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. aspect to it. And I think just 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 it has a little bit of a undertone to it. You know what I'm saying? The story that I was reading it was about um mm-hmm. the the article basically was like kind of like an op ed where you know the the writer is, is actually telling a story of herself so her story was basically you know i um, obviously she's a you know african american mm-hmm. woman and i guess she was uh what what state i'm not too sure of i'm going to have to look it up <clears throat> but uh she was actually down there she went to the store she was in college at at the moment at the time i think it was in florida as a matter of fact she's at college and she went to go um purchase um develop some photos she went to develop some photos and i guess like she had a pack of batteries in her bag Mm -hmm. from previously you know purchasing right right and she like she set off the uh alarm yeah and instantaneously like the lady basically like you're guilty yeah yeah you, you steal it either you sign this uh this waiver saying that you won't you know come back here and do that Again, or we call the cops, and she's like, you know what, call the cops. Yeah, because I'm I'm right. I yeah, know these are my batteries. I'm gonna find, I'm looking for the receipt for you right now. So she ended up going to jail because of it, right? Uh huh. That day, her mom posted bail, came from wherever she was. I think she was like in North Carolina to to where this you know individual was, picked her up, took her home. And on her way home, she actually found the receipt for those batteries. And she ended up actually um, filing a lawsuit and then, you know, you know, going through with the lawsuit and actually right. making them uh, making them uh, uh, aware that they were wrong. Right. Like they wanted to, you know, continue to you know fight about the whole thing. Yeah. And say that <clears throat> it was wrong. Now. The reason she brought this story up was because Kyle Rittenhouse was that kid that actually said that he you know went to the Trump rally or was it no it was a Black Lives Matter rally mm-hmm. and shot a couple people in self defense. Right. Now instantaneously he gets support from Rick Schroeder, <laughs> Silver Spoons, Rick Schroeder, yes, and some other famous people. He he posted bail. Two million. Mm-hmm. Now, do you under, Do you see the difference between those stories? Yep, most definitely, and that's what gauging into what we were just talking about the music and everything. This the it's it's the fact of we're getting a short end of the stick. You know, it's visible. It's very visible on every turn. On every turn. Yeah. So we get we we get screwed, and from that point of injustice of we 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 get accused and, and screwed over on things, but then he can. Go kill people. Well, the, here's the, here's the um the thing is is that instantaneously there's no there's no guilty until proven innocent you know no. or innocent until proven guilty no. with them because this was the total same reverse you know with the, with African Americans as opposed to whites. Now wasn't this the same kid that? The police was right there, and they didn't shoot him and everything. They just kept letting him walk in. Yeah, that's the kid that was walking down the street with his AR-15. Yeah. They didn't do nothing. Yeah, yeah. If that was a black kid, he would have been done. And as many times we didn't watch, you know. But, but.